as it's your boy Trey, how are you guys doing? I hope you guys are good. Now, your boy is back doing the old school reaction because unfortunately we got another copyright strike on the channel so we can't do no more live streams which means I have to go back old school. Yes, I know for some of y'all that's good news because y'all prefer these shorter videos so I guess it's a win-win for some and it's a win-lose for some. But what I can tell you is that I'm freaking nervous i'm about to watch barcelona versus juventus we are at home which is a good thing we beat juventus when they were at their ground but now we are at camp now are we gonna win i don't think so because we just have been waffled this whole season the only time we've won was against crappy teams we caught juventus off guard and don't forget in the first leg juventus actually scored three goals that were disallowed for being offside which they were but we are not playing good whatsoever. Barcelona looks dead right now. Uh, I'm nervous because there's a certain man called Cristiano Ronaldo on that pitch and somehow he always finds a way to score. I don't know how but he always finds a way. But in this game I don't think he's gonna score. I hope he doesn't anyways. I don't think he's gonna score. If he does it'll probably be like a penalty or something or a free kick or something. I just can't see Ronaldo scoring an open goal. <sighs> One more time. Messi and Ronaldo man. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not happy with our team lineup. I'm really not happy with our team lineup. I don't like the fact that we're starting Pjanic over Busquets. Obviously, I'm gonna be biased because Busquets is my guy. I don't like the fact that we're playing Pedri as the left winger and Griezmann up front and Trin Cow on the right. I hate that. I hate that team lineup. Honestly, I hate it. <sighs> They're practically gonna play five for the back, man. How the hell are we gonna go through that? How? How are we going to go through five at the back with Ronaldo and freaking Morata up front? Uh. Hey, Messi Ronaldo, give me the triple hug. Oh. Will be millions upon millions tuned in worldwide. To see these two great players and these two great That hurts players. seeing Ato wearing a Juventus jersey. It really hurts me. Honestly, I hate seeing that. And seeing Pjanic wearing the Barca jersey, I really cannot stand that. That really hurts me, honestly. I just want to find Bartomeu and just crack him on the jaw. And give him one of them. <laughs> right up got a left hook or something. Come on, kick off already, Jesus. Come on. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Mm, straight to Stegen from Ronaldo. Straight to Ter Stegen. But what a ball. We are under pressure, man. Honestly, we are under so much pressure right now. No, Ronaldo's got the ball. Ronaldo. Oh, good tackle. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Please check that. That's not a penalty. I'm sorry, that is not a penalty. Exactly. In the battle of the greatest, has the chance to notch first. And Ronaldo does score. And Juventus lead. They have been the better team right from the start of this. <laughs> Freaking heck, man. Thank you. That was not a penalty. I'm sorry. That was not a penalty. And the fact that they didn't even check VAR for it, that, that's even more freaking annoying. That was not a penalty. Beautiful penalty. Great penalty, but that was not a penalty. By any means, that was not a penalty. I'm sorry. That 
is extremely soft. Thank you. Oh, ball. Oh, what a finish. Now that's a good finish. That's a, that's a good finish. Thank you, look at Pjanic, he's the one we, we bought, right? He's the one a lot of people are saying should be playing over Busquets, right? That's him, right? That's the one you're freaking wants. We picked that over Arto. That over Arto. Are you... Oh, what a save from Buffon! What a save, that was on target. What a save. Oh, brilliant save, Buffon. Brilliant save. Nah, that's a freaking wall climb. Messi, tees up Pjanic. Messi, Pjanic, 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 Why do we have him? Why do we have him? Why? Good ball from Messi there. Messi! Ah, oh, straight to Buffon. Look at Messi playing Buffon. <laughs> Go <and> stop it. <laughs> oh, you gotta respect that. That's respect. That's respect right there. That's respect. You have to respect that. Oh, play. Jordi. Griezmann. Why did Griezmann not turn and shoot there? Like with his right. Oh, yeah, Griezmann's right footed, isn't he? He's left foot. He's one footed, sorry. He's left footed. He can't shoot with any foot other than his left foot. Straight at Buffon. Good shot though. On target. Another shot on target, but straight at the keeper. Oh, good ball. Wait, is that not a handball? Oh, what a save! <laughs> Just take it. What a save! Oh, that's a handball, mate. That's a penalty. That's a penalty all day. That's a penalty all day. The referee has to give that. He has to give that. That's a penalty. I'm sorry. I know it's my team, but that is a penalty. Referee has to give that. Why is he even looking? That's a pen. That is a clear pen. Why can't the VAR people just tell him it's a penalty? That is... I'm sorry. That is a penalty. Thank you. It's a penalty. Going left. Ronaldo's left. Yeah, and he does go left. Freaking scores again. You know what that means, right? This means I'm going to be getting a lot of messages from Ronaldo fanboys rubbing it in my face, talking about Ronaldo being the GOAT. I can see it coming right now. I can just feel it coming right now. You know what's annoying me? is the fact that we've created more chances. But we're 3-0 down. That just shows exactly why we need a number 9. We need to get rid of dead wood. Griezmann, Coutinho, Braithwaite. So many players need to get out of that team. Pjanic is one of those. Busquets should not be a starter, but he should be on the bench simply because of his experience. <laughs> Off the bow. <laughs> He's another one who needs to go. He just needs to go. Just go. Go. Very enough of him. He needs to go. Good ball in. But he needs to go. He has to go. I still don't know why we buy him. Oh, Messi. Oh, ball. What the hell was that from Bradford? And he disappeared in chicken, isn't it? Just good Oh, Messi. oh, nice, Messi. Oh, Buffon. Brilliant save from Buffon. Brilliant save from Buffon. That really good save. 
And we spent over 120 million on that crap. Why? Just get reads. Get freaking reads. Unlucky. And the good thing is, Push has inserted some sort of desire in the team. We're actually playing a lot better now, but the ball is just not going in. So, hey guys, um, the game finished 3 0 to uh, Juventus. Um, it's not much more I can say, really. Uh, kind of just amplifies the fact that we are a broken team. Like, we're really, really broken in every department attacking, creative. Midfield, defensively, everything is just broken. The only good thing we have in our team is Ter Stegen. And I'll probably say maybe Messi, uh, but Messi really doesn't look like he's too bothered anymore. He just looks like a man who's just fed up of everything because everything that's good that's happened in that game came from Messi. And if I was Messi personally, I'll be annoyed because it feels like you're a one man trying to do everything for everybody else around you. Nobody else in that team is really doing anything. It wasn't even like we, we got dominated in the game. It's just the fact that we're missing that crucial number nine. This is why I was saying we do not need to get rid of Luis Suarez. But a lot of people were saying we need to get rid of him. And get who? Because right now we're lacking goals. We are actually lacking goals. We don't have any good goal scorers left at all. We don't have any. Messi can be a good goal scorer, but he can't do it on his own because we don't have anybody else who can do the creative side of things. If Messi goes all up and wait to get the ball, he's not going to get any service, which means Messi has to drop deep and try to create opportunities for everybody else. But unfortunately, when you got freaking players like Griezmann who misses freaking everything, nothing is ever going to happen. <sighs> but that is it for me guys, I'm, I'm gonna go. Um, I need to go and cry because this is just painful, I, I can't deal with this. You, you know, uh, terrible game, I know a lot of people couldn't blame the ref. But at the same time, you gotta remember this referee was awful. Pjanic should have, like, he, he gave away a penalty, well he should have given away a penalty because he handled the ball in the box and that wasn't even given to Juventus. So that was just a terrible game for the referee and the VAR people. But you know what, enough complaining, I'm gonna go. Thank you so much for watching guys, um, it's time for me to cry and I'll see you all later and I guess on the bright side Man United lost so I guess that's good, it means they're not down. Alright, I'm out, peace, later y'all.